Where you at, Bear? Do you know half your team's dead? Perfect place to sleep. At least it's nice and warm. There's some corpses. All the, all the com commodities of home. That's the way up. There's much else here. All right, well, let's go. Come on, Tifa. Oh, Barrett must have heard me. I ain't done with you yet. You hear me? Think you can come up in here and do what you want? We gonna take it? Barrett! Tifa! Mr. T is pissed! Get your ass to her cup! Now! Chopper's gonna chew you up! Still alive and kicking? Damn right! Leading man sticks around to the credit roll! <laughs> no, we gotta keep moving if we wanna make it that far. You ready? Yep. Yeah, you're, you, you, uh, you know, their credit, you were standing next to something that was explosive. Is the fight rude again? Uh. Time for a rematch, huh? Rude! Well, Reno and, oh, Reno. Fight Reno. Still just as bad. All right, here we go. It's nothing personal, bitch. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> bitch. Miss me. Oh, you're playing dirty. I got a shot. I got a machine you're gun too. Asshole. Sorry, losers. We gotta play for keeps today. No time to dick around. Did you say dick? Plate separation authorized. Oh. Awaiting confirmation. Plate separation authorized. Awaiting confirmation. Get him, Cloud. Yeah, yeah. Coming right up. Huh? No, you don't. Not when I'm working. <laughs> Plate separation authorized. Awaiting confirmation. Here we go. Press it. Now, now. You ain't got shit on us. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Get my careful. He's quick. Yeah. We can run it away, baby. <laughs> In the trees. <laughs> Ow, you're a bitch! Sit still, you crackhead! I'm gonna put this big sword right up your fucking paper! You piece of shit! Cloud. There we go. <laughs> Fuck both of you with a fucking 10 inch dildo that happens to be spiked. I 
we do are we doing this? Any landing you can walk away from. Come on. Let's teach him the first two step. Oh shit, here we go. Okay, um what happened? Oh come on, I'm not gonna be able to do anything. What what are we doing? Nope! Okay, uh can I summon? Oh, oh that's trick! Alright, we're summoning. Who are we summoning? We're summoning Efrit. Fuck you guys. Have fun. Come get him, my Go get him, my horn friend! Ability. We need fucking for Tifa. <laughs> oh my god, you do so little damage. It's kind of ridiculous. On someone have something done. Now, now it's one on three, bitch. Oh, oh, it's her limit. Time to fucking get hurt, motherfucker. Confirmation. Do what you do best, Tifa. The fuck is with those things? Man, that is a sharp sword. How do we stop it? Who knows? Execute. Order 66. Where are you going? What in the fuck is with this shit? Get real tired of your shit. Uh, you? What is with this? Is this just stupid plot device? Yep, there we go. Late separation initiated. Late separation initiated. Commencing separation sequence. Flake! Section 1, separation imminent. Something that needs to happen. Here Flake comes the fucking demons. You son of a bitch! What have you done? <laughs> Cloud! Tifa! <laughs> Chosen one! gonna work. Uh, oh, we're gonna die. <sighs> what do we do? <sighs> nothing. There is nothing you can do now. You can't do this! Marlene! My Marlene! What did you do with her? Where are you? I'm at the... Sir, we're on. Damn. Your activities unwittingly brought you into contact with the ancients, who is now back in our custody where she belongs. For this, you have my sincere gratitude. Alas, the sector in which you stand has been complex. Ancient? Damn. You have to go now! And where exactly do you expect them to go? 
There's any hope of fixing it? Merit just fucked it all up. Well, if now we're separated. Oh, I hate. I hate it when it does timer shit. Okay, that's not working. Oh, we gotta go. Come on. Let me run! Stop fucking off, game! Shit together. Tifa. Get your shit together, Tifa. Come on, come on. Waiting for the plot device. All right. Hang on the big guy. I shouldn't have stuck around! Oh no! Oh no, what are you doing? Wedge! You dumbass! Wedge, no! Wedge! You lovable fat bastard! They blew it all up, those bastards! plate don't have to worry about sector 7 no more they did a broken world chapter 13 did this really have to be 13 chapters well, I guess we'll find out I mean, honestly, you guys kind of poked the hornet's nest. Like, you blew up Maka reactors and you're like, ha ha, we're saving the planet. Did you not expect Shinra to do something fucking ridiculous to stop you? Hey! Anybody out there? Farron! I think I hear him up ahead. And because of that... Hey! Can anybody hear me? Wedge and Jesse and Biggs. Here goes. All dead. And push. And push. <laughs> and no more Sector Seven. Marlene. Marlene. You know she's safe, dude. Money! Biggs! Witch! Jesse! This is my big moment. God damn it! What did you think would happen? God damn you! God damn you all! To hell! My hand hurts. Ali. It was us. 
We did this. Yep. It was shit. No. You can't think like that. Yeah, you can. Whatever came before it was Shinra that pulled the trigger to death. Am I right? No. I'm sorry, dude. You poked the hornet's nest. Yeah. Take her somewhere safe. And she did. You sure? Yeah. Pretty damn hey, sure. Where are you going? <sighs> Just like that. Biggs, Wedge, and Jesse were never thought of again. Ain't that a bitch? Continue through here. The ones who made it. The ones who were smart. How could this happen? I didn't really think that... What did you think they would do? And on top of that, they wanted you to stand there and keep people in and possibly, not even possibly, you are gonna die! What do we do now? What you were hired to do. Get these people out of here. You weren't hired to do that. You were hired to be a dead man. Shinra fucking don't care. wasn't an accident, was it? How would I know? It totally wasn't. Oh, excuse me. Oh, here we go. I said, where you going? Aerith's house. It's in the Sector 5 slums. And that's where Marlene is? Where we hope she is. Tell me she is. Give me something to hang on to. Even if she's not, I won't blame you for it, I swear. Who am I kidding? I'd probably try to tear your head off. At least he's honest, kind of. Hey Tifa, know anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original steward to the planet. Hmm. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. Yep, she can make flowers. Oh! Ow! There's one of those headaches again. Veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. <sighs> Hey, Claude, long time we'll see. Look at my cat eyes. <gasps> Meow. You have failed again, I see. <laughs> but through. 
through suffering, you will grow strong. Don't touch me. Isn't that the new one? Cloud? Hmm. That's nothing. Let's go. Tripping balls, Cloud. Everyone's watching you. What? Jesus! Bert! Calm your tits. Hey, pretty crazy, huh? Can you believe this mess? You doing all right? I am, but I can't say the same about my birds. Poor things are scared half to death. Do I gotta say, Chuckable Sam? Gotta calm them down somehow. I hope it's not sex. Times like these, people are gonna need our help. Well, at least you're a decent person. Wait, over there. What the hell are they doing here? Their jobs, probably. Just focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. Yes. Bedlam in Sector Seven, man. We could clean up, and no one would be the wiser. That treasure in those parts is ours for the taking. And we could wow. help uh. the injured while we're at it. Win -win. We need a nap. Welcome. Are you in need of accommodation? Yes! Have a safe trip. Thanks, um... The plate just fell on us, so, you know... That happened. Thanks. For the, the safe welcome wishes and shit, though. That's cool. Appreciate that. Yeah. Alright. Oh, the we're going. Oh, hey. Well, this is a fine mess. How bad is it here? Compared to Sector 7, we're doing fine. But that's hardly an accomplishment. Well, you're alive. However, did it come to this? Shinner is a bunch of dickheads. Is an avalanche that Sector 7's pretty much destroyed? Kicked the hornet's nest. You guys run into Jesse at the pillar? Yeah. She did. Biggs, too. They were both in pretty Let bad shape. Let me through, damn it! Let me through! But Wedge wasn't up there with them. He got out. No, he didn't. Right. He was trying to save his kitties like an idiot. Do, 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 do. Come on now. There's no need to be afraid. We're all scared. Do, 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 do. I've been thinking, y'all. We gotta go find the others. Huh? If we don't look for them, who will? They're dead. Right. Hey, Cloud. Gonna need your help with it, too. Right. I'll do this one for free. But Jesse's gotta, you know. Do a little something, something. <laughs> right, right, you know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? I guess you don't. Oh, look at that. You can see the sky. It's a really nasty looking sky. There's a sky in the house. What about the people that were living on the plate? Like, they're dead too. My ears are still ringing from it. This wasn't an accident, was it? Probably not. Not another bombing? Yeah, but they're gonna blame that on Avalanche. This is Sector 5, right? So where's this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Well, come on then. Pick up the pace. I'm going as fast as you are. Being a dick, Barrett. I can't even imagine how it looks over there. And now, where is the I'm gonna go find Aerith's mom. I'm gonna go find mom, who's probably gonna chew me a new asshole. Crazy. 
everything on the walls fell off. I really felt it. There's a crack in our floor, too. I fell out of bed. There was so much shaking. Look at all these kids. Excuse me. I don't think that's the, is that the way to go. I think it's this way. It's this way. Here we go. The planet weeps. That's the house. Molly. Marlene! Damn it, damn it! Baron, I can't take you anywhere. Where's Marlene? <laughs> Is she here? Baron! <sighs> Sorry, I'm Barrett. Marlene's my little girl. Uh, uh, she looks nothing like me. Marlene. She's got short hair. She's cute as a button, but with the heart of an angel. Aww. She was wearing uh pink. She was wearing a She's pink dress today. Upstairs. Huh? Oh. I said she's sleeping. Uh, yeah, be a good dad, you dumb bitch. <laughs> I want to see her too. Come on. Let's go look in on her. Not before I get yelled at by. Keep it Earth's down. Mom. Don't wake her. Maybe you should join your friend upstairs. Keep it down. Don't wake her. Uh. Marlene, my baby. Thank God. I wasn't talking, you dumb. Being an asshole. Everyone's an asshole to Cloud. Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. God, Tifa. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. Because she's an ancient. Is that it? So she told you about that? No. She, she must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. I can relate. About 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. Fred, how sad a story this is. But he didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Oh, he would dead. Every day I went to wait and to pray. Sadly. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. <sighs> My 
husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. Aww. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories. Like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility. And how she wasn't sad because Fuck you, her mother Hojo. had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no. This one, right here. I mean, what can you say to that? The prophecy was real. Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His <laughs> heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Damn. Things like that, she'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the knock. Hi there. You can no, call me Satan. Go away. Aaron, you know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, Who are the ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the promised land. Yep. Some believe the promised land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. You're the chosen one. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! But Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! Mm. I hear nothing. But all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's hmm. why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. And that they'll send her straight back home, once they get what they need. You mean Doubt. death? You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her too, I don't know if I could... If I could ever. You gonna pass out? Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Maybe that she's gonna make her fuck a dog. They're, gonna, they're fucking horrible people. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. It's crushed. Okay. Oh my goodness gracious.